Alright, I thought I'd shoot this one real quick. Um, this is an HD3650 512 meg AGP card. Um, I believe it was put out by Vision Tech. I got it off of eBay for like 30 bucks. Um, and not not with that heatsink, of course. Uh, the heatsink that was actually on it is right here. It's this piece of junk, passive one, that the card gets really hot with if I don't use it with, uh, oh, fuck that. Fuck me. Uh, if I don't, uh, keep this fan on it. Enough of that. Uh, <laughs> uh, instead of a Molex connector, it uses a floppy Molex connector. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, and I put it in here, and it's running nice with this, uh, little Pentium 4 box. Uh, in the background there, you see I dropped in my Auto G2ZS, which I have not, uh, installed the drivers for yet. I'm going to be installing the drivers that I f have found recently in the creative support forums. They're supposedly drivers that were rele uh, released in October of 2012 by some guy that I guess he was working with people inside and outside of creative to get these drivers done. And they supposedly have a little bit of a, uh, an advantage over uh, some stuff. You having problems in some programs, which I don't want. I don't want the problems, so I'm just going to use those. Uh, this little heatsink that's on it is actually off of, I believe it's an X300 or X600, something like that, uh, out of a, uh, I, I think it was a Dell OEM ATI card. Sort of like uh, this, but not as junk. See, that one's the, the weird diagonal crap one. The one that I took it off of, I can't seem to find at this point, but you get the idea. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There it is. This is the card I took it off of. Has the pattern, blah, 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 whatever. Uh, it says X300. So it's an X300, 128 meg, PCI Express card. So I took it off of that, and I dropped a fan on it. And it just barely makes the uh, the clearance. If I put a cover out over it, it hits the fan, and the fan stops. And the card gets hot. <coughs> so, what I'm going to do is right where the fan sits, I'm going to place in the side cover here, probably going to be right, right around here-ish. I'm going to put a... Uh, I'm going to cut out an 80 millimeter uh, <coughs> uh, cut out. And if I have it over here, I think I might have taken it out to the garage already. But I'm going to use one of those uh, classic uh, 80 millimeter fan grills to. Uh, yeah, I don't have it here. I'm going to take one of those classic 80 millimeter fan grills and just put it on there, slap it on there, and I guess use uh, something to keep it on there because it's not going to have a fan to screw into. So I'm going to need like. Uh, nuts and bolts or something. <laughs> That's going to be fun. Uh, yeah. For uh, comparison, about about this size in the side cover. So it would go right about there. Yeah, of course, that would be right about there. And I'm going to have the, the grill go over it, and it's going to stay nice and fine. And that way, this little fan will keep the card cool while I'm doing stuff, and... Actually, you know what? I'll probably leave this over and I'll open up Unreal Tournament 2004 here. Oh, there's my finger, it's going over the microphone again. I'm so bad about that. And I'll show you how fast it, uh, how hot it gets just, uh, In action. Uh, Deathmatch. Uh, let's do something a little more Phobos 2. <laughs> I always liked Phobos. It doesn't take too long to load, too. It's uh, pretty quick for a little fucking Pentium 4.
the fuck is that? I don't even want to know. There you go. What the hell is that? I don't even know. It's kind of hard doing this one handed, so. I'm just going to get my ass handed to me and uh, hope for the best. Not too laggy. Relax. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so just some uh, light gaming there. I'll just show you how hot it gets. Not even, not even forty degrees Celsius. That is crazy. With this little tiny heat sink and that fan. So I'm impressed. Before I had this, uh, that big ass heat pipe heat sink on here, this little thing is fine. I mean, af after you get the old thermal compound off and you, uh, uh, lap up the, the, um, surface pretty nice, it does a decent job. So, uh, I guess that's my, uh, eight minutes of, uh, fun shit here to share it with you on, uh, you the viewers on YouTube. I'm going to be doing some uh, other crap with this. I'm going to rehook up the uh, optical ports, I guess. I've got to figure out if I can put those in on the uh, uh, Audigy card or not. Someplace. I'm going to have to look up the pinouts for something like that. Alright, so that's that. Found another pending 4HT sticker. Uh, I got a, I got another one there. <laughs> and i got to figure out something with this uh, little coil here. It's a little loose uh, uh, with the um, uh, the, the, the whatchamacallit, it's a little loose. So I gotta figure that out. But it hasn't, uh, hasn't, uh, made anything worse or anything, so we'll see what the deal is. I'm gonna figure out some of that too. And the fan back there. Alright, so that's it. Alright, so, uh, enjoy, comment, whatever the crap you wanna do.